hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix a destination folder access denied problem we encountered this error while placing the dll file in our system folders guys the first solution is consists of two steps guys the first step is to become the owner of the folder where we want to place the dll file to place the dll file into the folder we need permission which we can grant to ourselves only after becoming the owner of the folder guys to do this open up file explorer select this pc double click on the local disk c double click on the windows now search for system32 and sys wow64 this both file in here you just need to right click on the system32 and select properties select the security tab over here and in here you just need to select the advanced in advanced you just need to select this change option over here select change and in here you just need to type users u-s-e-r-s click on check name and select ok after as you can see the folders owner has been changed now and you just need to check mark the replace owner on sub containers and objects just need to check mark it and select apply and ok I see a warning like this appear guys you just need to select apply the reason for the warning is that file inside of the system 32 are important and windows want to protect these files to proceed click on yes and proceed to continue guys there are like 30 files now we can grant ourselves the necessary permission to place the file dll file guys after giving granted permissions we just need to second step is to grant ourselves the necessary permission to do this right click on the system 32 select properties and select in here security tab over here and you just need to scroll down and check whether you have a user in here in my case user is already listed here guys but if it's not there you can add it guys for that you just need to select edit select add first i am going to remove it guys for showing you guys select add guys in here you just need to type users u s e r s users type it click on check names and select ok now we have added users guys now you just want to select the users now and give them to full control guys permission for users to full control access to all of the permissions and select apply and ok it will work for the permissions for you granting them and to apply the same steps we did for that system 32 you just need to apply for sys wow 64 guys hopefully your problem will be resolved that's it for today's video guys give me a like and subscribe thank you